Here at home, a four-story building was built to come crashing down. And tonight, a group of engineers working at UC San Diego is celebrating that collapse. Yeah, that project was to test just how shaking, how much of it would bring down a structure. And tonight, researchers are one step closer to being able to keep your family safer. It's called a shake table test. Three, two, one. We wanted to see if without retrofit, how much, you know, how much this, um, this building can take. This four-story wooden structure built to 1920 standards is Poria Bamani's baby. I designed this building. I was uh, following, I've been working on this for a year. 52 weeks of 14 and 15 hour days are about to come tumbling down. We developed a, a new way to uh, to determine how strong and how stiff those retrofits should be. The team of researchers at UC San Diego, led by a Colorado State University professor, was expecting the building to collapse on the second or third shake, but it held up better than expected. We wanted to collapse it and see, you know, what would happen and then get the information and prevent other collapses. How strong, how stiff do we need to make those retrofits so we don't force the damage up into the upper portions of the, the building? Then... On the fifth try, Bamani's building came crashing down. The collapse startles him, and then he starts to cry. It's kind of sad too to see a building that you designed from scratch and like shake it a lot, and then see the collapse. Afterwards, there were hugs and handshakes for a job well done. Another part of this research was to test how buildings with first four floor garages can better handle earthquakes.